bells of holly. Fa la 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 la. Tis the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. Don we now our gay apparel. Fa la la la. Guys, so I thought I would sneak into the bathroom and do my makeup. I'm actually in my guest bathroom right now. Um, because Eloise is currently distracted, which is a rare thing. So just. Throwing on some BB cream, some concealer, I don't know. And that didn't last very long. I only got on my concealer and powder. And then this one came in here. It is a Christmas miracle. I was able to put some makeup on to feel alive. Eloise is hanging out right there. Eloise, wanna say hi? I just have to change my days until Christmas to 24 days. Well, by the time you watch this video, it'll be 23 days, but today is December 1st, so I gotta change that. Yay! Are you excited? We should turn on these lights. Yeah. 24 days. These are so Christmassy, these pizza party lights. <laughs> we are watching some of my old Disney World vlogs and Eloise loves them. There's a scene where uh, you see the Triceratops ride go around and Eloise points to it and goes, Wee! 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 No. No? Yeah. Yeah? Which one is it? No. No? <laughs> we're season pass holders, so we're really excited for our <laughs> next trip. We don't have a set date yet. We have like a rough guesstimate of when we would like to go. And um, I don't know, Eloise loves it. Like she's been already when she was four months old and then she's been again when she was one year old and now she's a year and a half. And she loves it. She really likes the Triceratops ride. But the next time that we go down, I kind of want to do Universal for two days. Uh, we haven't taken her to Universal Studios yet. However, uh, my husband and I have both been to Universal Studios. Uh, I think we went, I don't know the last time that we went. It's been like a few years. And I personally like it because of all the Harry Potter attractions. Uh, and the Jurassic Park attractions. They have a really awesome Jurassic Park ride. Um, but in Jurassic World, there's this ride that we tried to get on and you have to have a kid to go on the ride. It's like, I don't know, it's like a flying thing. And so I'm excited because now I have a kid to go on it with and they won't deny us access to this ride, you know? I know, I'm such a kid at heart. It's so weird because when I was a child, I never really cared much about Disney World or Universal Studios. I didn't even like care to go, but it's not because I had like uh, a bad opinion about these places. It's just I didn't really know much about these places. <laughs> and now as an adult that I know about these places, I love them so much. Uh, Louise, want to come say hi? <laughs> Why are you screaming? Do you want to do you want to see Mickey? Where's Mickey? <laughs> She's obsessed with Minnie and Mickey and Olaf. Where's Olaf? Where's Olaf? That Yeah. Is that Minnie? Is that a Minnie pillow? Oh. Wow, speaking of Disney, do you like Minnie Mouse? Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. I feel like every trip that we go Bye -bye. on <laughs> ever since she was Bye -bye. born, it's something new to look forward to. And this time, the next time that we go, I feel like she will recognize like some of the characters she'll recognize Minnie and Mickey she'll recognize if we go see Olaf she'll recognize Olaf so she, her excitement level will be a little bit more whereas when she was a year old and even when she was four months old it was more uh just think about her enjoying the moment and seeing the sights and listening to the music 
Um, but I feel like the next trip for sure is more going to be like recognizing these characters. Because uh, she does have a really good memory. And she even like points at some of the rides from my vlogs and like goes wee wee. So she like gets really excited about them because I think she remembers them. So as a parent, it's really exciting to see the things that you love, but through your children's eyes. It like gives it a whole new perspective and a whole new appreciation for life. So yeah, sorry for the little spiel about Disney World, but we are a Disney family. She is a Disney baby. Um, my husband and I, we did honeymoon at Disney World and it's just something that's near and dear to both of our hearts and now Eloise's hearts. Hearts. She has one heart. Oh my gosh, I thought Rambo was sitting right there, but she's not. Eloise, what are you doing? This is the Disney World album. Look, that's where we went to Disney World. Yeah? Is that Olivia? And Mommy? <laughs> is that you in front of the tree? <laughs> it's so funny. I was just talking about Disney World and what, do I, what does she do? She goes and gets the album that we have that I put together from our last Disney trip. B. <laughs> yeah? Wow. wow. You're a gentle baby. Gentle. What is that? Are all these pictures from our Disney World trip? Wow. Do you want pasta? I'm gonna make some leftover pasta. I'm gonna have a big thing of sauce. Mmm. Are you are you helping mommy cook? Hmm? Are we cooking? Is that what we're doing? Yeah? Mmm. Do you want some pasta? Do you want some pasta? Yes. You want to see pasta? What's over there? Is that Chase and Marshall? Where's Cobra? Cobra's out there somewhere. Oh, where are you, Cobra? Say hi. Hi, Chase. Hi, Marshall. Do you love pasta night? Hmm? I think you do. You made almost your whole bowl. Is Cobra there waiting? Hmm? Mm -hmm. All over your face? Really? It's time to clean you up. But you can't? Are you in a food coma? It's time to clean you up. Ah. Ah. All right, guys, that's it for today's video. If you like today's video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for day three.